Okay guys, so we're printing uh, Builder Plate number 4 of 6 and I just thought I'd start by showing you the beautiful uh, interface I deal with. So if we just zoom in a bit there, you can see the layer that I'm printing. Off to here are some controls to move the extruder back and forth. You mainly use them uh, when the printer isn't running. And uh, down here are some very useful things. You can set the uh, heater and the bed to a certain temperature for whatever you need. And over here is just a running total of the temperature of this of the system. So you can see there, my um, my extruder is running at about 184 ish, 183 ish, and the bed's at 63 degrees Celsius. I'm happy with that. Basically, you want to print at sort of 185, 190, and having the bed at about 60. So that's about right. So moving on, let's have a look at the printer here and see what we're printing. Now I've run out of purple, so we're printing in baby blue. And uh, we're about halfway through. And these items here are actually these items here that move the z-axis Z there. So this, this bit here and that bit there. Now the hexagon shapes are fit an M8 nut that when attached to the threaded rod, which is this uh, on the left here, where my finger is, that uh, is driven by that stepper motor. And as the stepper motor turns the threaded rod, there's actually a, an M8 nut there, which you can just see, that gets pulled up. And that's how uh, the Z-axis moves up and down. So there you go, uh, four of six, we're not too far away, oh my god, there's been some issues. Uh, I'll just pull out from my junk pile. This here is a, a piece that stopped working. Uh, it stopped working about 25%, you can see how it's printing in the middle there. And uh, yeah, that was a little bit annoying. What happened is that I just stacked this new roll of uh, blue blue stuff here and it, it actually fell over onto the printer <laughs> and knocked the z-axis up about uh, half a foot so I came out and there was trailing blue stuff everywhere so let's hope this print gets to the end cheers guys